Hello people, I haven't really posted anything with a voiceover on this channel in a very very long time, but here is my reading journal from 2023 as well as the setup of my um, 2024 reading journal. So yeah, my 2023 reading journal wasn't as pretty I guess as mine right now. This video has been in my drafts since December of 2023. Well, maybe more like January, I think. Yeah. So, I I don't know. I've just been very busy and stuff. Some of this is really, really ugly. And I was like using up a notebook I've had for such a long time. So, yeah. Um, here is what I'm going to be using now because yeah this notebook is really cool I've been really wanting it it has multiple colors of pages like a craft paper color and a black color and normal white color now I'm starting to actually set up my 2024 reading journal um I I just I just watercolored a thing to go on the front page, and that's what I'm doing here. It's supposed to be like a manticore destroying a bookshelf with fire and stuff. I don't know why I did it. I thought it was cool. I, th I think it is kind of cool, I guess. I don't know. Um, I wanted the main of the manicure to be kind of like a gal galactical afro, so that's what I did. Here is where I started to put together my cover page for 2024. I'm ripping up pages, well no, I already have them ripped up. I'm, I'm ripping up pages from the book Among the Hidden. I got this book from a library's recycling. My, my old school's library's recycling. Um, it was already falling apart, so I'm not wrecking a book that isn't already wrecked. 
Um, they know they started to burn it, but that turned out to be a really bad idea because this book is really, well, not a really bad idea. This book is, like, really old and really, uh, um, fragile. So, it burned freakishly easy. And I was kind of scared of starting a house fire, so I only burned two, and I was like, okay, oh, yeah, that's fine. Because it's like, it's supposed to look like the manticore himself got into it. So, I was a little annoyed that the my painting of the manticore is slightly off-center, but I made it work out in the end. This is the point where I was ready to write words onto this setup. So I took um, a little teardrop shaped ink pad and I took a paintbrush and I just got ink on it and I brushed the ink using this stencil because I wanted it to look like warm or like it is fire within itself I guess. So, that's what I did for this. But some of the letters turned out kind of too faded, like you almost couldn't see if they were there or not. So, I took this, um, just normal black pen and I traced over the letters with the pen and the stencil to make them more visible. At this point, I began setting up my to be art or to be read list. Um, I just wanted to be simple, just like lines on a paper, and I put the I put will put various book titles on each of the lines, and then around the um, the lines, I collaged just random papers and I'm, I will put the title TBR above it. At this point, I'm working on setting up a tracker, but this little stamp thing is so annoying. It took me like two hours just to print a whole year's worth of months. Way too long, but it turned out looking cute, so it's okay. At this point, I am starting to write down the books I know for sure I want to read this, well, this current year now, but at the time, this coming year. And I put little checkmark uh, stamps next to all of them. It would have made more sense for me to do it afterwards, but at the time, what I was thinking was I would fill in with black where the checkmark is, and I've been doing that, but... 
I almost wish I would have waited on that one until afterwards. I haven't really added much to this list at this point. Um, hopefully I will add more. I'm sure I'll add more. Um, but I have been working through my TBR a lot this summer, which is pretty good in my opinion. At this page, I am beginning a... My library does... It started first last year, and this is the second year doing it. I've been doing it both years. Um, a challenge called the Open Books Challenge. I'm making a spread for that to help me keep track of the books I'm going to be reading. I'm titling it similar to what I, how I titled my front page with the manticore. So that's what I'm doing here, just working on titling it. 2024 Open Books Challenge. It's a challenge that you read a book, 12 different books um, from different categories that they give you on this sheet of paper. And there are 15 categories they give you, but you only have to read out of 12 of them. At this point in time, I think I only have three books left. So later on, you'll see in my next video what how it looks right now at my halfway point. What I began doing here is I was trying to section off, figure out how it would fit um, all of the books and stuff on this one page. What I ended up doing I really didn't like, but at this point in time now, I have fixed it. And you'll see that in the next video as well, how I fixed it. Because I thought I did the math right, but I actually did not. So, yeah. when I start setting up my January section so that you can see how I did just the January part of this journal and eventually of course you will see every month of the year and how I set it up so that's what I'm doing here I just got these new pastel watercolors, so at this point I'm beginning to, first of all, to open them because I've never used them before, and I don't know what any of the color looks look like, so I'm just swapping them on a little swatch card it came with. Now I use this watercolor palette all the time. The black in this palette is much more opaque than any other watercolor black I've used. Like, you hardly put any water on there, and all of a sudden it's, like, so dark. And usually watercolors are known for being more light, but this one is so dark, so, yeah, it's a really nice bit. <laughs> Thank you. 
So now it's time for the final flip through of everything in this notebook. Here is the opening page, um, my monthly overview with books, pages, and average pages per book, and then all books I read in 2024, it throws a couple more pages. This is my TBR, um, my monthly tracker, and um, here is my open books challenge spread, which will be fixed eventually. And this is my January spread. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked my first um, real video in a long, long time. Bye.